What's up guys, this is Triple M and today I'm very excited to be bringing you what I think is probably the best handheld multifunction keyboard slash air mouse out there. This is the Re i28, it's a 3-in-1 wireless mini keyboard, it also has touchpad, black light, it's rechargeable so no batteries to have to fumble with. And this is compatible with Raspberry Pi, Mac OS, Linux, IPTV, Smart TV, Android boxes as well as Windows. <laughs> Now guys, at first glance, this looks like a video game controller, <laughs> which isn't a bad thing. In my honest opinion, it feels really nice in your hand, it's really comfortable, and um, it has the, the main navigation buttons up to the top right, so you move these with your thumb, your volume up and down, left, right, as well as your page up and down and your OK button on the right. In the middle, you actually have the trackpad, um, which also doubles up as a scroll and up and down when you use the function key. So that's really useful. Uh, a little bit about this remote slash keyboard. It has 70 keys. It does require a USB dongle, which included in the back of the remote. And I'll show you guys when we get into the unboxing. It also has a built-in touchpad, which has an adjustable DPI. Uh, LED black light also has an auto sleep function which is very handy for for any device that's using battery so like I said the design is, is very functional very practical in my opinion let's jump into the unboxing kind of show you guys what I'm talking about hi right, guys so here's the re i28 and this is the one that I'll be giving away later so please stay tuned towards the end of the video to show you guys how to win all right so uh, just a standard um, retech box that it comes in. Not too much information on the front or back, just a picture of it, as well as some of the features that it has. But um, let's go ahead and pop the box open and see what's inside. All right, so we have the standard uh, USB extension slash charging cable. And if you guys are not familiar with it, what let me unwind it, give you guys a better idea. <clears throat> so basically it doubles up as an extender as well as the charging. So uh, you'll plug this part into your computer device to, or your USB brick and then plug this part into your remote just to charge it. And if your USB hub is in a hard to read place, you can plug this in there and plug the receiver right here uh, just to make that wireless connectivity so that's pretty cool put that to the side all right nothing else in the box this is the thank you note that comes with all the, the remotes from retech all right here we have the quick start um, guide slash user manual so definitely check that out when you get a chance and let's go ahead and open the plastic, which is really tight. And here it is. First overall, feels really nice in your hands. Almost feels like a like a video game controller. And in some instances, it looks like one too. You have your left click, your right click right here, which um, used with the mouse function with the touchpad buttons really tactile feel you feel the click in your head as well so that's pretty cool all right up top you have your um play pause button right here in the middle you have your volume down volume up fast forward and rewind button to the right you have your navigation keys up down left right your okay button and you have your touchpad right here you have a full keyboard here as well as additional function button so for instance you get function in the windows key it'll bring up your your start menu on your computer which is pretty cool here's the function for the black light hit function hit the black light button and that will light up your keyboard and it times out after three minutes i believe all right the back just has the model number let me pop it open and show you guys what's in the door all right so all that is is the usb receiver you just pop it out Put in your device and you're good to go. And go ahead and put that back on. Here's your on and off as well as your USB charging port. Let me go over these three LEDs right here. And the 
first one I hear, that will light up red when your battery is low. The second one is a solid blue when you've made a connection with your receiver. And the third one, it flashes orange when it, it cannot make a connection. So if I turn it on right now, when it's not plugged into the system, you can see it's flashing orange. Also be showing you guys some night um, photos of what the keyboard looks like when it's illuminated at night. But right now if I hit the function and the, the LED button right here, you can see it comes on. It's kind of hard to see in the daytime. And that's it for this part of the video. I'm going to show you guys what, um, how to use it when it's hooked up to the computer. And I'm going to show you guys some night photos as well. All right, guys, so I have it plugged into my computer. Let's go ahead and turn it on. All right, so the LEDs on. As you guys can see, I have the solid blue right here, which means I'm connected. If you look on my screen, I'm moving uh, the cursor around. So let's right click on the desktop. As you guys can see, it brings up my display settings just like it would be if you right click on the mouse. And it's just a left click. And this is good, or this is practical for instance, if you want to drag something. So you'll just click there and then you can move it around wherever you want. So that's pretty cool. All right. Let's just go to YouTube and check out the keyboard www.youtube. Buttons are really responsive. Go ahead and push enter. All right. There's all the things I like to watch. <laughs> so I hit the function, and you can go ahead and scroll up and down the page. Just hold it down and just click the mouse pad right there. All right. Volume up or volume down. Volume up works. I just. Um, Go to one of my videos here. And you can go ahead and click right here too. The video I just made today, so you can double click there. And I'll turn the volume down for you guys. And you can do it another way, just drag it up a little bit. Let's make it full screen. Alright, let's check out the Windows key. So function, hit Windows. There it is. And of course, you guys know that the black light button works right there. All right, so not much more to cover. Um, basically, went over is just a full keyboard has functional buttons. Um, the selling feature is definitely um, the mouse function right here, and, and the actual design of the keyboard. I believe uh, it just feels like a video game controller, and it's really comfortable. Uh, the buttons are really nice. You guys can see the escape button brings me right out of the screen just like it would. It's only $27 on Amazon. I believe they dropped the price from $32, so definitely a steal when you think about it. Rechargeable battery um, works on multiple devices. Um, definitely a must-have if you have an Android stick or Android uh, device that, that you use often, especially with Cody. If you type in address links or website or searching anything you'll need something like this because it's frustrating using the actual remotes that come with these devices so these are a must-have so i'll put the link in the description for you guys to check it out and if you guys have any questions just shoot me an email or uh, leave a comment in the box please like subscribe and thanks for watching